Assalamu alaikum dear student today I am going to talk about the scapular anatomy its side determination and the anatomical position of the scapula here you can see this bone is called the scapula so the scapula have two surfaces one is the dorsal surface this is called the dorsal surface it is convex and the other is the uh, costal surface which is concave it has uh, three three border this is called the lateral border here you can see this is called the lateral border it is thick and it run up to the inferior angle and this is called the medial border of the scapula it is thin and it also run up to the inferior angle and this is called the superior border so it have three processes one is the acromion process this is called the acromion process the other is coracoid process this is called the coracoid process and the other is spinous process of the scapula here the spinous process divide the dorsal surface of the scapula into two fossa the fossa just above the spinous process is called the supraspinous fossa here you can see in the fossa just below the uh, spinous process is called the infraspinous fossa and it has three angle uh, one is the uh, superior angle here you can see this is called the superior angle and this is called the inferior angle of the scapula and this is called the lateral angle in the lateral angle there is a, a cavity which is called a glenoid cavity and there is a tubercle here you can see this tubercle is called a glenoid tubercle so the side determination <coughs> the uh, lateral angle of the uh, scapula is always be laterally and uh, the dorsal surface of the scapula is always be convex these two things actually determine the side determination so this bone is uh, uh, left scapula left scapular bone so this was all about the scapula so thanks for watching the video